I've got to confront you. I know in the absence of John Studd and King Kong Bundy, how do you get yourself in this kind of a mess? A handicap match with Hillbilly Jim and Andre the Giant. Two men facing three. Big John Studd, King Kong Bundy, and yourself. You are well, nervous, aren't you? No, I'm not nervous. I just want to collect my thoughts and make sure everything I say is understood properly. Because it's obvious the World Wrestling Federation here doesn't listen to me, and they don't care about me. Yes, I am a gifted athlete and a wrestler, but I don't particularly care to wrestle. And they know that. The whole thing is between Andre and the Hellbilly and Stutt and Bundy. And just because some goon at seven foot four and 500 pounds and some dumb hick from Mud Lick put their two heads together with an IQ of 10, they want a, me in the ring. They want to get their hands on Stud. They want to pick up that money for a slam. They want to get rid of Bundy because they're jealous of his size and massiveness. And they want to get rid of me because they're jealous of me. My whole life, everybody's been jealous of me. Everybody's been worried about me my whole life. You're they've paranoid. done this to me. They've done this to me. Don't you call me Weasel either, pal. No, I didn't. You, I you said, said you're it. paranoid. No, you called me Weasel and I heard you. I, I said you're you, trying to weasel no, out of this no, match. No, no, I didn't try to weasel out. I just don't want to have anything to do with this match. I want to sit down in that chair. I want to guide my men. I don't want to get in there. I don't want some guy seven foot four putting his dirty, filthy hands on me. I don't want some hillbilly putting his dirty farm hands on me. But I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. And you think it's a handicap because there's two of you against three of us. It's a handicap in your part. Because, Andrew, you were carried out of the Maple Leaf Guards in Toronto. And hillbilly Jim... You thought you stole the Manager of the Year award from me and gave it to Albano, and you didn't, because I'm Manager of the Year. And they carried you out of there, too, after that. They carried out Albano, and I'm going to guarantee you something. Thursday, on the 12th of December, they better not bring any ambulances there to the Oakland Coliseum. They better bring some big dumpster trucks where they haul the garbage out, because that's what they're going to carry Andre out of there with and the hillbilly, because Stud and I and Bundy are walking out of there, and don't you call me Weasel. Somebody just call me Weasel call here. Weasel. Somebody's calling me Weasel. It must be from behind there. Fans, go listen in Oakland on the 12th. Weasel!